and talking about some of the sort of the details behind it. We have an, an all new battery pack, and then something we're really proud of is the new carbon sleeved rotors for the motor. So this is the first time that uh, there's, a, to the best of our knowledge, there's been a, a production electric motor that, ha that has a carbon overwrap rotor. This is a super hard thing to do because uh, carbon and uh, copper have very different rates of thermal expansion. So in order to do a carbon overwrap rotor, you've got to wind it at extremely high tension. It's a very hard thing to, to do. We actually had to design the machine that makes the, motor, the rotor. So it, no such machine ex existed before. It also means we can make, have the electromagnetic field uh, be super efficient uh, and have a tight gap even at super high RPM. And this is, it's single speed from zero to 200 miles an hour. So it's just, it, the, the RPM is so crazy that just the centrifugal force wants to expand the rotor. So the carbon overwrap actually holds the, the rotor, to, basically holds the rotor together. <laughs> it's, like, it's like madness. We're going to show you the motor. In fact, you might have had a chance to see the drive unit. I mean, this is really a, an amazing work of engineering. There's, there's just never been a, an, an electric motor like this. I mean, you can pick this motor up with your hands, and, and it can accelerate a two-ton car to 60 miles an hour in two seconds. I mean, that kind of power to weight is insane. Yeah. So it, it, goes, uh, we've, we've, it goes up to 20,000 RPM and maybe a little more. So we also have the latest uh, and greatest uh, in heat pump, which is the, basically the HVAC system for the car. Uh, it's 30% better cold weather range uh, and requires 50% less energy for cabin heating and freezing conditions. Um, yeah, so it's, you'll see very little degradation in cold weather. Um, and the radiator is uh, twice as big for heat rejection. So you'll be able to actually do back-to-back -back zero to 60s, um, go on the track, just haul ass, and uh, as you'll see tonight, this car is just going to be over and over again, and it doesn't get winded. I think we've got to take this uh, back to maybe the Nürburgring. Let's uh, see what happens.